Hey, tonight I bring you an amazing show about how you can take three scripts, make two different stories, and make yourself a better voiceover artist. All right, let's do it. This is VO's Journey. With your host, the incomparable Anthony Pika. Hey, what's going on? Uh, I am bringing you the next uh, video in this series of How to Voice Act for Beginners, uh, Part 4. All right, and, and tonight I've got a cool uh, activity for you uh, as well that you can do to practice... Uh, your voiceover skills. Um, and it's called the 3-2 storyline activity, okay? Um, basically, in this activity, what it is, is it's set up to where you're going to find three scripts, okay? And you're going to come up with two different storylines for each script. So meaning that um, you, you have a script and you are going to create context or a story that goes along with the script. Doesn't have to be long, okay, but just something to where you can you can uh, you know kind of picture yourself. And 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 here's the thing: we want the stories to be different, okay, so that we can go ahead and practice reading these scripts from two different angles. Okay, and this is a great activity to get you trying to move out of your comfort zone and and get outside the box when you go to perform. All right, and it, it kind of opens up your mind of possibilities to how you can do, uh, you know, how you can do different types of voice acting. Okay, so um, I went ahead and I just I picked a script uh, that I found, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and um, I'm going to uh, come up with a story. All right, two different stories, and then I'm going to read it for you as an example, okay? And then I want you to uh, watch that, and then your job will be to go out and do your own thing, okay? And and to make sure that you are are picking three different scripts, and you're coming up with two storylines for that script, okay? So the script that I'm picking tonight, I'm going to read it to you. It's just just normal read. Um, it's um, and I have it up on my up on my board here. Or my if I could. <laughs> Let me see if I can pull you around here. So I'm reading it up on my screen. Okay, can you see that? Yeah. So I'm reading it up on my screen while I am filming this. So that way you can kind of see me while I'm doing uh, my filming. So anyways, the, the script is, uh, do you want to earn a degree from the University of Virginia but need the flexibility of online classes? Online bachelor's degrees are now available for part-time study in cybersecurity administration, creative leadership, and knowledge management. It's not too late to get started. Classes start January 14th. Okay, that's the script, all right? Now, what we're going to do is we're going to come up with two storylines, all right? And what I mean by storyline is we're going to give context. And here's the deal. We're going to make it up, okay? This is the secret sauce if you want to know what makes actors... Uh, shine above other actors or, you know, what makes performers better than others is their ability to be creative, okay, and to, you know, make a decision about what, how they're going to act, all right, with, with, you know, without being prompted or told, they just go out on a limb and try something. Sometimes they crash and burn. Sometimes they're a huge success, okay, but we're going to make some decisions. We're going to make up some stuff, all right. Uh, and, you know, that that's why we by the way, that's that's why we're being paid to do this. It's not just to read it. OK, it's to bring our own unique talent to the shot or to, to the voiceover. OK, so that's something that, you know, we're going to do. So for this one, let's make up two different stories. All right. So let's just start with, uh, you know, uh, who I am. Uh, let's say that I am a um Let's say that I'm a middle-aged person, okay, in my 30s and 40s, uh, and I am um, maybe let's just let's say that I I just got out of I'm just making this up. Let's just say that uh, you know I, I'm 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 a, a single person, okay, who's had a variety of relationships, but never has anything stuck. I'm kind of a loner, uh, but I'm really I'm really ambitious. 
uh, but I've been stuck in a dead end job for umpteen years. Okay, so I'm a little frustrated, and uh, you know I'm looking for something that is going that excites me. I've always liked computers. Uh, I've always wanted to be, you know, I, I like helping people, uh, but I've never really gotten the chance because I've been stuck. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm anxious to do something new. I'm anxious to help. All right. Uh, and, you know, I, I, I don't have the constraints um, of maybe, let's say, uh, a family, but I do have the constraints of a job because I still have to work. So I don't have time to go, you know, every which way I need to be able to do my stuff from home. Okay, so from that story, I just just came up with, you know what I mean? I'm a middle aged guy. We'll say I'm a guy. All right. Middle aged guy. And like I just said, I'm, I'm anxious and frustrated uh, with where I currently am. I want to do something new. I want to do something exciting, but I need the flexibility because I'm, I'm still having to support, you know, myself and my current lifestyle. Uh, so I can't just leave and go do something. All right. So from that point of view, I'm going to go ahead and read it. Okay. So I'm going to read from that one and then see if, what, what you get from those things I just, just described, okay? Um, do you want to earn a degree from the University of Virginia but need the flexibility of online classes? Online bachelor's degrees are now available for part-time study in cybersecurity administration, creative leadership, and knowledge management. It's not too late to get started. Classes start January 14th. Okay, so, you know, that, that was what it was. I felt like I was pushing the envelope. You know what I mean? Like I was, I was a little anxious about it. It was a little, you know, harsh because that was the character I was feeling. All right, now let's create another story. All right, let's say that um, I am, uh, let's say that I am a young guy, all right? And I um, want to uh, travel, Okay, and I want to be I want to be out there experiencing the world, but I really still want to uh, dig my teeth in and get into cybersecurity because maybe it's a part of my life. Maybe uh, I feel very strongly about it. Maybe my father uh, or my mother was a part of uh, a company that you know is is very uh, oriented towards you know maybe my family is very oriented to. Um, you know, online security and, and, and helping people and, and, you know, going after the bad guys, you know, maybe that's thing, or maybe my father is actually in the, um, maybe he's like in, in um, uh, the government where they, they, they go after uh, cyber criminals. Okay. All right. So I'm more young. I'm more upbeat. I'm more excited about the possibilities, but I want the flexibility of being able to be a millennial. Okay. So I'm going to try it from there. All right. Let's try it from that context of that story. All right. Uh, now, me being young, I've got to change my voice a little bit, see what I can do. Um, and we'll see if it comes across. It might, it might not. Here we go. Um, do you want to earn a degree from University of Virginia, but need the flexibility of online classes? Online bachelor's degrees are now available for part-time study in cybersecurity administration, creative leadership, and knowledge management. It's not too late to get started. Classes start January 14th. Okay, so that was definitely not as harsh. It was more like a, a younger, upbeat kind of thing. Um, you know, now, mind you, what we're doing is we're just practicing. We're pushing the envelope, whether it makes sense or not, all right, whether it seems right or not, don't stress about that. The idea is for you to think in your mind about how you can take something and, and come up with a story, a context that you can turn into your own uh, acting style, okay? Um, and that's a great, this is a great technique. I could have gone a different way. You know, I could have done something that was completely different. Like, maybe this is serious. You know what I mean? Maybe, maybe you know, this is targeting a serious group of people that mean what they're talking about and they mean cybersecurity. That's what it's about. You know what I mean? And it could be more serious about it. Uh, you know, like, um, do you want to earn a degree from the University of Virginia, but need the flexibility of online classes? Online bachelor degrees are now available for part-time study in cybersecurity administration, creative leadership, and knowledge management. It's not too late to get started. Classes start January 14th. So, I mean, that was a completely different read 
right, of a more serious nature. So I, I hope this helps. It's called 3-2 Storyline Activity, okay? The 3-2 Storyline Activity. And it's basically you getting three scripts. For each script, you're going to come up with two different types of storylines, two different reads. And you're going to go through each one, and you're going to read it, record yourself, and I want you to listen back and honestly listen if it sounds different to you, okay? Does it sound like you've made a change? Does the pitch in your voice change? Does the inflection change? Do you get across a different idea of your character? Okay? This is the type of practice that we have the luxury of doing. Okay? That we can do by ourselves. And if you are struggling with listening to your own stuff and hearing it, become a part of a group. You know, I have a Facebook group. It's called The VO's Journey uh, on Facebook. And, you know, you can join that group and post your stuff there. Uh, and and talk about uh, or, or or post your stuff and get feedback uh, if you're having a hard time yourself a lot of times it's difficult for us to actually listen to ourselves and make you know um, and 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 figure out how we actually sound because we listen to ourselves all the time so it's good to have other people listen to us as well all right so I hope this helps out uh, remember it's called the three two storyline uh, activity. Okay, uh, please make sure that you subscribe uh, so that every time I come out with a new video, you go ahead and see it. Make sure you tick the notification button so you won't miss a, uh, miss one more. And uh, thank you so much. Please like, comment, tell me if you have any uh, different techniques and activities. All right, thank you so much. You have a wonderful, wonderful night. Peace.